an elo who is quite annoying with his speed. Yeah, yeah there, there are some, some players who definitely made Solek very successful. But let's go and start on Synthesis, who immediately try to cut off Ether for that light armor, but no. He fails he the double jump, one. he gets another one instead, and despite them being very close for such a- Whoa, this is what I meant! And then 190 <laughs> stack is gone, direct rocket into a railgun. And this is how Synthesis starts it off. Fortunately for Ether, this one is not finding its mark, and this is a nice read. That Ether's not gonna go back the same way he went to the railgun. And now, yeah, now it's just a matter of time until... Ether is gonna pick up that light, as he just did. <sighs> Huge damage, though. And there's the frag. Ether had no right to go there. He needed to make that decision like half a second earlier if he wanted it to be successful. Absolutely. He should stay on the heavy. Oh, just go directly to heavy. He has no read, uh, right to listen to the pickup. But yeah, this uh, rocket was quite miraculous. Uh, I think this is something we need to know. <laughs> something you every quake will need to know uh, this angle. I was quite surprised about this hondo. And started the yeah the solar count ga hunt game from the get go. Yeah. Synthesis hits everything now and looks very patient and uh, calm. Rail after rail finds its mark and now Ether finally is able to answer back. Synthesis is so weak that he can't afford to peek himself and another huge rail hit from Ether oh. from down below mitigates or equalizes the rocket damage that Synthesis did. And now it's 12 HP for the German and actually a mega health for the Solag. Yeah, delay pickup worked very well for Synthesis, so he had a, a free heavy. So it was good that he stays there without showing his face to know uh, if the Solag is going to Oh, heavy huge heavy. rockets there! Wow. Ether, and this time it's Synthesis who is fairly too slow, and Ether back to back rails. Gets the lead. From the spawn. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I mentioned. It's the spawn rails. Wow. Ooh. Yeah, now... No, usage of the ability. Ether, Ether gives Synthesis some of his own treatment, landing huge rockets and rails. Making the life of the Doomslayer incredibly hard at the moment. Relegated to the outer side of the map, where literally is nothing but railgun and nailgun. Now Synthesis found his way onto high ground, got himself an LG, but ate a railgun for it and can't reply. Ether now is in good position to pick up that item, but gets ignited by some lightning gun of Synthesis here. Oh, yeah, but the position is... is yeah, I was gonna say, positional-wise, Ether was, was fairly uh, decently stacked, and there you go, combo frag, two frags up now. But this speed is uh, what Solak makes so dangerous, right? All of the champ would, champ would not be there in, in a second of the pickup. So good usage of CTMA by Ezer. Exactly, and now and blocking the way to the item with the spit and another railgun to finish it off. How many is this? How much is this guy hitting at the moment? Yeah, rail is annoying from Ezer. And another oh, one. The synthesis does not look so crispy at the moment. Hope he's coming back. Wow. wow. The direct from down below. Hi, Frax, and there we go, another one. Oh, the health bubble just saves synthesis. Barely, huge rocket. Just, uh, now I he's feel like it was before nope. the item pickup though. So it could have been more, yeah, it would have been more beneficial for synthesis. Uh, but now a lightning gun fight and it seems like either despite the huge stack advantage, you can't come out on top here. Now we have a rail oh. from the German. But it's all I can say. I was quite surprised that the Ezra goes for control and not for the push. Uh, yeah, yeah, it cost him a lot actually. Synthesis is quite annoying, hit some nice shots now. And kills Ezra before the pickup. So he's back on track. Still not railable, nice. Well, the rocket jump by Heather. That was but a creative play, though. 
Yeah, true. But costs a lot of stack. He has no flash damage reduction. That was quite expensive rocket jump. Yeah, and I mean... They were fairly similar stack, but then with the rocket jump and all the lightning and from Thinsisith. But no, the rockets are just too much to handle either. Lands a direct into what's just enough to get another frag here again. And despite not getting the heavy stack wise, he's still looking solid. Rails being traded actually is favoring synthesis as he denies another light. Nice shot from the Solak here. And oh, if he hit that angle, that would have been crucial. And a yeah, beautiful prediction rocket, thing. barely not hitting. And now it's time to set up for Mega. Three seconds it is, and they choose to fight before and in another direct from the Solek, forcing the spawn again, but this time Synthesis is delaying his respawn, gets the lightning gun and the item, but also gets burned by the acid and loses out on the heavy. Oh no, this is this is not good. And there we go, he should be dead here. Yeah, that was such a strong spit. On the two health bubbles was 200 IQ play actually. Was perfectly usage. Yeah, Azure extends his lead. I think Rail did it in the beginning, but now he also tried to bully and expand his control. And that's where Azure is very annoying. He changes now the timing. Abuse the sound cue box. But since this is LG, it's nothing you have to joke about. Quite hitting hard. Yeah, that was that was some serious damage that Ether took. And the self damage he did before and actually now comes back to haunt him. I was feeding a, a raid in the back. But the synthesis was not ready for it. <laughs> what is <laughs> going on? Close. Both oh, are extremely low. Oh. Water blood rate. If, if Ether turned around and guided, guarded that jump pad, I think he could have gotten an easy frag there, but no, he can't. And now Synthesis is landing rail after rail on his opponent. Ether is weak, falling back to the railgun area and tries to get some stack back, but Synthesis is where the item is going to spawn. Two and a half minutes, five frags on this map, totally possible. He needs to land those shots now. Oh, and there is the push. Nice. I love the fact that he kept spraying lightning gun. He had enough ammunition. And this way he would ensure that as soon as he see, sees a pixel of the Solek, like, the damage would come out. And there we go. Four frags. Two minutes, basically. It's, it's possible. Loses out on the Mega, but it doesn't matter. The rockets and the ray gun is huge. Wow. And a follow-up shot, too. Synthesis Why is now is he on going fire. For rail? What big cojones shot the plus would do it? No, he needs to rail for it to finish as there is the moment. Yeah, because Very frags beautiful. only count when they are stylish, right? True. So three frags, 90 seconds easy for synthesis. Or not? Question mark. Oh! Uh, He's so lucky that there was a pillar which he flew against. Otherwise, I'm pretty sure we would have seen the, the Doomslayer take a swim in the ocean right there. Oh, found his opponent. The spit is being used too and no effect at all. Rail down off the spawn. Very into important there. A light armor is actually huge because that will mean that Synthesis is actually in favor when it comes to stack. There is no lower light, so... Despite a little I bit like of health, nothing of to take. Synthesis there, he can, from this position he had, he control every move of, of Ezer. But now he loses out on heavy. Played it a little in, bit too long, this control position. Yeah, he forced the situation too much when he knew where Ether was. Oh, beautiful rail, now he needs to change pace and charge forward. Ether though, drops down. Nicely read by Thinsisith, and they will meet again. No, Ether hurts his opponent quite early enough to back down and double back from that bounce pad. And now a railgun close range into the punches, and there is the mega health to pick up. Oh, yes, it's possible. Oh, no. 
Two more rails need to be hit, and there's no stack left on the Doom Slayer. He misses one, and this is it. There's no way because Ether can duck behind the corner and clutches it last second by not being hit. Look at the railgun damage of these two. What a rail fest, and also the percentage is quite impressive. Yeah, that was <sighs> nice. Very well played. Unlucky, the synthesis has had no rockets left at the end and also no shotgun. It was lacking out of, of everything. But he had to push like this, he had no time 